hey guys welcome back to the channel so i'm recording a voiceover because the audio in this video is not the best so basically this is me at kfc enjoying myself after i had gotten my visa from the tls office that is the uk vi office in abuja the thing had seriously stressed me so i was so glad when you know i got the visa it was successful so i just had to take time out enjoy myself and you know just thank god for the success of it so yeah so basically this is going to be behind the scenes as i prepare to move back to the uk <laughs> so after having lunch at kfc i started to stop over at a mall to pick up a new wig because i needed a new wig the one i have is already worn out so yeah <laughs> Hey guys, so I'm making a quick stop to, um, I want to get a week, I need one more week, a new one, so I'm trying to get it, so making a quick stop to get that and then move right along. <laughs> hey guys so this is day two and my plan for today basically is to make my hair so i'll be getting locks because we all know that in the uk uh, making hair is expensive so i'm going to make locks that i can carry for a really um long time and then also i'm going to be talking about the dress that i have on so i got this dress from omanes underscore clothing on instagram you should definitely check her out um i didn't set up my tripod stand so i'm going to try and give you a view of the dress um the best way i can so this is the back of the dress and then now i'll give you a full view i totally love that this dress has pockets like it's very functional i like simple dresses and this dress does it so ensure you check her out on instagram at omanes underscore clothing and now i'm heading down to the salon and this is jabi lake it's pretty popular in abuja so if you're ever in the city make sure to check it out and this is just some more view of the city of abuja <laughs> new hair who this who this look at that hair oh my god she's so pretty new hair who this i mean your your fave could never they could never <laughs> So um, I have collected my wig and I want to go make my nails and then do my COVID test for my flight so just a bit of running around today um, so yeah okay so after getting my nails did i decided to go get my covid test done so this is me at the lab where i did the test so 
so i went to the lab to get my samples taken had the covid test done and i got the results the next day and as god we have it it was negative so i was fit to travel i was good to go and this is me heading down to the airport i had to leave really early because my flight was for 9 a.m so um <laughs> I, I was heading down to the airport with an uber that i had booked the day before yep Okay, so i can't remember what actually this is but i just knew it did not taste nice um but i was eating it because girl was hungry so i ate it regardless of the taste but it definitely wasn't the best thing and this is london heathrow i landed um some minutes past 2 p.m uk time so here i am at the airport just trying to figure out my way and then i had to go to baggage reclaim but the craziest thing happened here i waited for over an hour just to get my bags at this point i was seriously exhausted and just like i just wanted to leave the airport at this point so finally got my luggage and then headed to the exit to go meet jason who had been waiting for me for a while and here he is <laughs> and of course he got me hot chocolate sweet boy <laughs> So we went on to just um, find a place to sit down while we ordered an Uber and we just had to wait a little while for the Uber and it came and we left and headed home. <laughs> So at this point I was exhausted, I was beyond tired. The girl was exhausted from the flight um, and if you look at my face, see tiredness. <laughs> I just wanted to be home. <laughs> 